Hello wonderful people, welcome to yet another vlog. So in today's video, I'm gonna take you along with us to go visit some houses. House hunting. House hunting, yes. So it's going to be house number two, three? Three. Three. House yeah. number three that we are seeing. I uh, forgot to take you along with me, but this time, hey. So yeah, we are in the mood to, we are ready to move. Basically our house is becoming uh, pretty small and we want to have a bit of a more space to work. No, aka studio record videos and just more some more storage stuff but finding a house in Chigali for everyone who has looked into it is not as easy as it looks so I'm just gonna take you along with me and uh, maybe I'll explain along the way how the whole process um, looks like don't forget to subscribe give this video a like and come with us house hunting So guys, step number one is of course is to get in touch with the commissioner. And for me, I just look them up on Facebook, on these groups, and I call them. And then usually they have one house, and then they will send, you, they will bring you to some other houses. So this guy, I found him on Facebook. Uh, I called him. He gave me a number of this other guy. And so this guy I've never met is the one we are waiting for right here. We are supposed to meet at this road. Can I go? Yeah, at this time, but. Um, so I'm gonna call him to see where he is. So se second step is to go view the house, and uh, that's what I'm gonna do now. What <laughs> Yeah, that dacht ik ook wel een beetje. Few moments later. Okay, house number one was a fail. The landlord is not uh, available, so we could not enter unfortunately. So uh, we're gonna make another appointment. So, but we're gonna go to house number two. Are you sure that you know me? Maybe that's treated you poorly, made you great coffee, hid you from the cops. I used to make you come. It's still very dicht by the gym, but then on the other account. Imagine it's this one. Oh. <laughs> Babe. Oh man, this one. What? Okay, so guys, this is the neighborhood called Kagubu. Uh, reason number one why I like this is because it's close to the gym. That's like the biggest reason. Um, and the house also looked fairly uh, new with lots of uh, vegetation from the pictures. Unfortunately, someone's still living in this house until the end of the month, so uh, which would be perfect timing for us too. But we still decided to go and uh, have a look at the outside in the neighborhood uh, because you know, this kind of like great houses here move fast, so you gotta be on top of it. Uh, so, the funny thing about this neighborhood, it looks a bit uh, deserted, but behind this neighborhood is a very expensive neighborhood called uh, Mucho Estate. Um, so, I think that people live here are uh, estimating that you know that kind of new newness will come to this uh, area as well anyway we're almost there let's take you to house number two It's here. 
dat is met uh, in het huidige huis het ook al twee jaar. Oké, okay. so guys, we are here waiting on the commissioner. He is late. Uh, but so we're waiting in the middle of the road for him to come and pick us up and to bring us the location. Mm -hmm. uh, One hour later. Theo is driving now, but we just saw, look, we did not see the inside of the house, but uh, we just saw that because there's still people living in there, we just saw the outside and to be honest, getting there, look at the road, it's just a hustle to drive through this road, so I was not that enthusiastic, but then when you get inside, like the compound, it's super green it's uh, the homeowner was there it's well it's just great it's just great we were we made an appointment to go look at the inside this evening uh, but i'm in love i'm in love and there's a dog the things i find important a garden and a doggy yes Guys, thank you for joining us on this wonderful journey and uh, maybe we're gonna see some more houses we will see in the next video. Or not. <laughs> <laughs> Oh